So, good evening. Uh, Wednesday, the sixth of May, two thousand twenty, and once again, you're welcome to our Mel Kjold's daily online sing song for the soul. So again, we're just <coughs> waiting to see that we have a sound yeah. check, the sound's coming back. <coughs> so you're welcome whether you're here in real time or you're coming here as a... Uh, yeah, we're here, yeah. Okay. So oh, is we're... Joe King. <laughs> All right, super Sheila stuff. McMahon. So again, you're welcome. Uh, Teresa Laverty, John Cooley, Ray Atchison and uh, others. So. Again, welcome back, guys. Again, we are blessed once more with a lovely evening. Um, let's say we met someone as we walked along the shore today. Uh, Ray one Anderson. Of, one of our erstwhile, uh, just bottle this down, one of our erstwhile singers at our regular session, and uh, he was telling us that <clears throat> it was 21 degrees he got out of his car today, but suddenly he's telling us that you're going to be down to nine degrees on Sunday night or whatever. So, as ever in Ireland, that's the way. When the weather's bad, it's going to get good. And when the weather's good, it's going to get bad. So we never should be surprised at <coughs> the change of our seasons, etc. John Coyle, you're welcome. And uh, Ray Byrne, it's your night tonight where we're going to be attempting to sing some of your songs, Ray. Um, From a sunny, coolie peninsula. Yeah. So the songs we're going to do, not in this order, but... We're going to be doing Cliffs of Dunin. We're going to do Follow Me Up to Carlo instead of Wagon Wheel. It Doesn't Matter Anymore. Uh, American Pie, King of the Road, okay? So there, so again, just to remind everyone, this is our Desert Air Island Discs scenario. So the whole idea is we're encouraging you. One, the whole idea of this whole uh, online sing song is that we sing together and have a bit of fun together, a bit of diversion, passing the time. And, and also we get a chance to practice and play songs that we would like and we hopefully, when things come to a point we can mix with people again that we'll be much better inclined, a bit more confidence and a bit more familiarity with songs. Yeah. So we've asked people to uh, <clears throat> note down five songs that they would take with them to a desert island uh, if they were going to be incarcerated there to get them through the period that they're there. So we had, it's on our third night, we have Nat Natalie Breiter from the shed outside Dortmund. The first night yesterday, we had Marilee uh, yeah, the yeah, yeah, Cunningham yeah, yeah. From, um, from Harpers, Harpers Creek, Ferry. Harpers, Harpers Ferry, Ferry sorry, West in, in West Virginia. And tonight, you know, all back on the east coast of Ireland in the, the land of the Brown Bull of Cooley, Tonbo Cunningham, we have Rayburn from the Cooley Men's Shed and Ray has <coughs> stepped up to the plate and, okay, there was one song he had requested, Wagon Wheel, which we just had a look at as a commander and said, look at Mary, we're not um, fixed with how that might work. So look, at, we put that down, Ray, to, to get right. Sorry, just picking up my capo. And, um, but so the five songs again that, uh, we've cho that you've chosen, Ray, that we're gonna go along with our Cliffs of Deneen, Follow Me Up to Carlo, doesn't matter anymore. American Pie, King of the Road. Lovely choices. They're out of the two books. Yeah. And uh, so that's what we're going to sing those tonight. We're also going to sing um, a, a practice birthday. song, Dicey Riley, mm -hmm. which we've done. I think it's a good practice song because it's a long song. Lots of opportunity. It's simple chords, only two chords in it. And you had lots of lovely words to put our, uh, our lips around. And then we have a couple of other birthday songs which will include Good Night Irene for um, Irene Hayden and The Dimming of the Day for, for Mary, Mary Clark and, and her sister in, Margaret and a special request for Margaret's uh, Old Flames sorry I didn't I forgot Margaret I don't know whether it was uh, The Crystal Chandelier or Old Flames or Old Flames so we're going to sing them after 8 o'clock as yeah. part of our birthday routine uh, <clears throat> So I, again, if you're if you're out there, it'd be lovely to have you register your presence with us through the comments, yeah. as we have Louis Brown and Fergus Tui, etc. Uh, and it's just wonderful people that we have this sort of um, uh, little, I suppose, 
online community of interest going on uh, that we're in, we, we can all enjoy. And I hope, I hope, like us, we have a sense that we're enjoying playing the music, and I think we're developing a a bit of a yeah, look. I think we're getting somewhat better. I was just I saying to Liam today that uh, at least we'll probably be better in remembering the words after this. We'll we we'll know the words of the song somewhat better. But just to talk to you a little bit about King of the Road. And Ray has, um, somewhere he's sent a message to Facebook. He says, King of the Road, that's 1963. In my leaving search year, I hitched to moat to take part in the Gail Lynn debate. I spent a couple of hours, because I was early, I spent a couple of hours in the Bon Bon Cafe in moat playing this song on the jukebox. Very good. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Then were the days, Ray, when going to moat was like the same as uh, a weekend in Magaluf or as you do go to New York to check out the prices in Macy's or whatever it is. But in those days, going to moat, well, that was a big thing. So, Ray, I'm not sure if you sent, did, did you say Ray he sent did, some he photographs? Did, he did, yeah. He sent them to Metal Kill. So, Ray, I'm just going to see if I can find out how I might even find out where they are. How will they find out where they are, Mary? Um, uh, I don't know. So I suppose that's our fault. Just to say that today, um, we did the the wise thing, and so you sent them we to the group, I think, the music group. Sorry, I think yeah, that's probably. Did, yeah. I don't so know. I'm not sure. Nigel Mary, O'Mahony, uh, wonderful day in Dublin, just back from our local park, where the night where the highlight is the eight new signals hatched in the last few days. We'll try sending photos. Do that for your, your night. When, when's that coming up? I'll let you know later on. Anya New York is here from sunny London. And Ruth Cleary is here. A beautiful day in Letter Kenny. So Anya, we've received your list of songs. We've received Ruth's list of songs. Uh, we have received Nancy and Chuck's list of songs. Uh, so Fergus and... Um, Whoever else is out there would like. Dave Kelly, uh, still waiting for yours. Maria Fordham also sent a list of songs. So we'll get around to, to those. Uh, so Dave, there are just two songs that I have for you, but I'd like the others. Okay, thanks. So Ray, I, I'm just I'm a bit confused. I'm on another device here trying to look for... Mary said you sent photographs. Did, I haven't seen them, so unfortunately that's... I'm not sure where I, I would even perceive them or whatever, but... Uh, if you can send them to uh, Ray, I think we're friends on Facebook and Messenger. So if you can send them to Messenger while we're doing this, great, we'll include those. It'd be nice to, it's just the whole idea was to send some a list of songs and maybe some photographs associated with them. So look at Ray, I, I'm sorry that I haven't managed to pick up these. And just to say, Mary and I are not that long in from, from a walk, so we're very happy we did that. But anyway, that doesn't stop us singing our songs, guys. All right, so look at we've been messing around a wee bit. We'll go to King of the Road, that's the song we'll sing, yeah. I think, wherever it is. I hope, uh, King of the Road, yeah, okay. And we're going to sing this in um, G. G. So again, probably this is one of the songs I haven't managed to uh, increase in its, uh, to reduce the width of the lines yet. But we'll see, we've done a lot of work in both books. Yeah. Uh, almost just... there, almost at the keys, actually. Yeah, yeah. but anyway, look, at, I hope we can read this. So playing it open. Trailer for sailor rent. Room to let it 50 cents. No phone, no pool, no pets. No cigarettes of butter, two hours of bush and broom, buzz and eat for them for me. I'm a man of means by no means, king of the road. Bart box car, midnight train, destination pain. Smoke old stogies I have found Short but not too big around I'm a man of means by no means King of the road King of the road I know every engineer and every train All their children Every 
I'm getting locked when no one's around to say they trailer for sale rent. Room to let at 50 cents. No phone, no pool, no pets. Ain't got no cigarettes about a two hour no pushing room. Buys an eight, but then. Trailer for sale rent, room to let at 50 cents. I'm a man of means, by no means. King of the road, king of the road. I'm just the king of the road. That's the one. Lovely okay. song. Lovely song to start. Another one from the radio years ago. Uh, anyway, good luck. Uh, hello, Maria Fordham. And again, look at guys, I'm delighted that people decide to come at any point for any length of time because we know that uh, there's a lot of things going on at this time of the evening. And also, uh, when we met our Liam Maloney down at the beach today, he was pointing out so many beautiful sunsets are there. So, Mary and I are having the conversation about, uh, you know, whether about adjusting the time that we do this at, uh, in so far as. When we started this, it was dark at seven o'clock in the evening. Obviously, it's a lot brighter now, and also there's lovely evenings there, so it might suit people now that people are uh, in some way uh, enabled to be outdoors. This is in Ireland, obviously, in the States and otherwise, time and in, in Germany, things are slightly different in terms of time. But mm. anyway, we're only beginning to have that discussion ourselves uh, to see that. But so delighted, Marie, even if you stay if you're with us for a while, Valerie Burton, how are you? <coughs> you're welcome. Uh... So you're welcome back. Uh, we missed you. Um... Yes, Dave Kelly. Dave says, "Great evening, everyone. Another great day for weather. Hope this isn't isn't our summer." I hope it um, is. And well, put it like this, Dave. I'd rather have our summer now, even if it turns out to be terrible bad weather soon. Done. Have terrible bad weather and be hanging on, hoping and hoping and hoping. I'd rather have me, uh, as I say, me a hand in, a bird in the hand is worth two in the bush. I'd rather have it now. And wouldn't it be wonderful if the summer was like the summer of 2014 when Mary and I spent five months wandering around uh, from June until November, wandering around in, um, in West Brittany, where the weather was very similar to what it might be here in the west coast of Ireland. And it was just gorgeous and it was majestic. So look, it might be one of the, wouldn't it be a lovely uh, tail end to a very bad couple of months and then COVID and But then we went to England for a further month from, uh, from France. I think the weather was very good there too, wasn't it? For yeah, the, it wasn't bad. Obviously it was dark. Once you get into that time, it was dark. But look, we've got a number of months where at least it'll be bright and let's keep our, our hopes up. So the next song we're it going to... It doesn't matter <clears> anymore, yeah. Okay, we're going to sing It Doesn't Matter Anymore. So Mary... Sheila, Sheila, that's 187 book one. Sheila likes to be told the numbers of the books. So just to say, you know, I've repurposed these books. So they, they look the same to you, but the numbers are in different places because songs now spread over a lot more pages. So that's just, don't concern so, yourself. I'll, I'll have all the pages up anyway. So it's on so, book one. Sorry, so just a little bit about the song from Ray's perspective. It Doesn't Matter Anymore, 1959. He said... Pick strawberries in Taft's and Black Rock. Johnny Taft. During school holidays. Spend some hard-earned cash in the local Malacca's chips and delicious ice cream. In Malacca's shop, buying chips and delicious ice cream. Buddy Holly, um, <coughs> classic. <coughs> it got plenty of plays on the jukebox. That's what he says about that song. Look at wonderful memories to Ray, Ray Byrne from Cooley. I, I mean, I, I, look, I'm 64 years of age. You're somewhat older than me, obviously. Ray, you might want to share us your age. But it's interesting, John, Ray there remembers picking strawberries in Taft's and Black Rock. So Johnny Taft, the man who owned it, was one of my teachers in school. I'm not sure where you went. To, well, it would have been in primary school, so probably from Cooley. You wouldn't have been there if you were from Cooley. But uh, my memories of Johnny Taff is he was always, we would have considered him to be a hard teacher. In fact, you got lots of slaps from Johnny Taff. But the one thing about it, he was extreme. Like, look, we lived in a context of physical punishment as a <clears throat> the best recognised way in, in what Porrick Pierce called the murder machine, the educational mm -hmm. um, process to 
mug and jug type of education where if you force to coerce things down people's throats they could regurgitate them ad nauseum which in general terms was true and added to by a couple of slaps but Johnny Taff all of us I always we were it was always very fair you never had the in, thing never had the intent or the sense that with other teachers he was getting any pleasure out of it, it was just something he had to do but seemed to be a fairly fair man but strawberries and taffs imagine yeah. picking strawberries and what you go along you pick along the strawberries and you stuff yourself for the first first couple of days, and, and you don't, don't earn any see money. Them again, it's like working, yeah. in a, yeah. like working in a biscuit factory. You do the same sort of thing, and then you never want to see that. And they don't mind the guys who own the place don't mind because they know that everybody has a propensity for eating strawberries until they stuff themselves and after to get over it. So, uh, do we need open again? Uh, I'd say it's probably up a few myself, to be honest with you. Three. Maybe. There you go. So I'm trying that in capo position three. Uh, your memory is a Buddy Holly singing this again. Lovely renditions by Buddy Holly, but for me, definitive versions always was the magic voice of uh, Linda Ronstadt in the mid to late seventies. Just gorgeous, you know. And Malacca, Sheila McMahon, yes, Malacca's, or as it was called, uh, McCann's in Black Rock later on. But yeah, lovely times. We tend to look back in those times with uh, we we just remember the good days. Don't remember too much about the bad days, right? Oh, there you go. Right, sorry, just say, sorry again, just in case it didn't get to the cabo's in position three, everybody. There you go, baby. Here am I, well, you left me here so I could sit and cry. Well, golly gee, what have you done to me? Well, I guess it doesn't matter. Tribute song? I don't think so. I, I thought I thought that Ray, tribute song. I wouldn't think so. I thought, well, I thought Ray said it was a Buddy Holly. Tribute. Oh no, I presume it's a Buddy Holly song. A Buddy Holly, a Buddy Sorry, Holly not Holly tribute. Song. Song. I don't. Of course, it's a Buddy Holly song, all right. Mm. But I say the defender version probably <clears throat> that I fell in love with was the voice of Linda Ronstadt. Uh, beautiful. But the other thing is that's the now last week because you know, <laughs> Mary and I are uh, we have to admit are really good on intent, not so bad on content, mm. but. Uh, Delivery in terms of practice now wouldn't be our high point because we do other things like today, 
go for a walk on the beach and just and the swim a beautiful be the second day completely immersed in the water day getting a little better just like it's paradise paradise yeah so Nigel and um, Anthony said pick strawberries and other fruits in lambs beavers town done about great memories yeah I, remember, I would have passed that uh, driving out by done about I would have placed those and weren't they lovely uh, ways of passing simple days in the summers uh, and you know should the strawberries did us no harm either but no, but I've seen last week we did actually practice a couple of songs after breakfast one morning, and that was one of them. And that's the first time we have so we, we choose to sing the song with leaving gap. So there you go, baby gap. Here am I when you gap. Left me here so I could gap. Sit and cry. No, look, yeah. you may or may not like it that delivery that way. That, but for the first time ever, Mary and I got on message about that. It was really enjoyable singing that with Mary because it worked very well. Oh. And the other thing at the end there, when when we say "wasted all my days over you," Mary wanted to sing that yeah. slower. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and so we actually sang that quite well together. So look at I, my, our encouragement to you is that if you're as mediocre as us, um, both start and finish and end, you can improve. And we, I'm sorry, but we have improved. We're marking ourselves now. We listen back to this and, you know, we give each other independent marks and we add them all up. But it's fun. I think if you practice and look, when there's 500 songs there, it's very hard to get a handle on a number. Of them. But our objective at the end of this is to be able to sing a number of um, of songs mm. together that that we would and then what we're saying is the next learning task for us would be to say pick seven songs and learn them to be able to play them without the book so we could just pick up the yeah. instruments at any time and do them so again i think people can create different aspirations for themselves and what they'd like to develop so what ray says is and yes i should have remembered that ray because i've it written here in my notes it's american pie that's a tribute to buddy holly yeah, so in fact, that's our next song. So this, I, I, I always loved this song and I always wondered would I ever get to be able to get the words anywhere and then be able to sing them. Uh, and so in our second book, we talked about this for a long time because in the physical book, as a, just again to remind people um, that the physical books look like that there, that's what they look like too, majestic, magical books, proud to be associated with them. Um, fantastic and again someone again asked me today I said on behalf of someone else I wonder could I get a copy of the book and you post it out and I said right now we have a whole um, a collection uh, boxes of those books uh, which we have been had been distributing prior to all of this mm -hmm. and we just felt that this COVID time complicated I don't want to be complicating issues we wonder when stuff comes in the post should we touch it should we leave it there for a couple of days the books will <coughs> they're evergreen books so we, we took the we took the direction to um spread the book around as a PDF free and just pass around. So again, if you haven't got your copy, just click on uh, the Metal Kill Song Group, join the group and get the copies free and bring them down. And we don't see yeah. these as I mean, a physical book and a PDF, they're complementary rather than contradictory or alternatives. Yeah, so Dave so. Kelly says uh, that last song was very nice, no matter which way you do it, whether you do it with a pause or whatever. So Paul Griffin is here. Hello, Paul. How are you this evening? Um, so the next song we're going to do very So what Ray says about this song is, um, this reminds me of my teaching days when we were... Sorry, go on, Ray. Yeah, this reminds me of the teaching days when we went on long haul trips to the continent. This is a tribute song to Buddy Holly. Always a favourite to shorten those long journeys. And the other thing is, it's a really long song. So, you know, just like a lot of the songs that we sing, like Kill Kelly, we sang yesterday. It's um, that's only half the length uh, no no but I mean it, so the song works best as that story so again as we sing the song it moves through different moods I'm not sure if we're competent enough to carry all the moods appropriately but again irrespective of that the whole thing is to try it now this is the first time we've had this song broken uh, the f song is multiple pages long now because there's less words on each line so again you'll have to bear with me as I move along the section like that but we'll do our best we'll sing i'm going to try it up in capo position too <laughs> again uh 
So on your work says, remember Don McLean sitting in the guest chair beside the burn on the late late and blasting the sash. It was amazing. Yeah. So let's try it in capo position too. Two. I say do it in memory of those again for me I suppose it carries a memory of a magical summer somewhere back in that time. I'm not sure for me if it was possibly seventy five, six, seven, those no. Four, five, or six, maybe that sort of time. The years might have been out there. But you know, we those days we all knew some of the words and we sang along with them. We just probably didn't know the whole lot of it because it was a double A side, as I said. Right. Long, long time ago, I can still remember how that music used to make me smile. And I knew if I had my chance. I want to see if that might work Which better, higher. So. Three or four. Long, long time ago. Yeah. Okay. Long, long time ago. I can still remember how that music used to make me smile. So sorry, I'm playing that up on four. Apologies again, we're not familiar play with it a lot. We'll try it on four and just see. Again, I'm not in any way prescribing to you how you might play it. Hiya, Willie Pierce and Maureen Diver. Um, but let's try it and see. A long, long time ago, I can still remember how that music used to make me smile. And I knew if I had my chance that I could make those people dance and maybe they'd be happy for a while. But February made me shiver with every paper I deliver Bad news on the doorstep I couldn't take one more step I can't remember if I cried When I read about his widowed bride But something touched me deep inside the day The music died so bye bye, Miss American Pie. Drove my Chevy to the levee, but the levee was dry. Them good old boys were singing whiskey and rye, singing this'll be the day that I die. This'll be the day that I die. Did you write the book of love? And do you have faith in God above? Do you believe in rock and roll? Can music save your mortal soul? And can you teach me how to dance real slow? Well, I know that you're in love with him Cause I saw you dancing in the gym You both kicked off your shoes Then I did those rhythms was a lonely teenage pumpkin but the pink carnation in a pickup truck but I knew that I was out of love the day the music died. I started singing bye bye Miss American Pie drove my Chevy to the levee but the levee was dry them good old boys were drinking whiskey and rye Singing, this will be the day that I die. This will be the day that I die. Now, for ten years, we've been on our own, and my scrolls fat on a rolling stone. But that's not how it used to be. When the jester sang for the king and queen in a coat he borrowed from James Dean. Sorry. Oh, and while the king was looking down, the jester stored his thorny crown. The courtroom was adjourned. No verdict was returned. And well, Lenin read a book on Marx. The poor dead practiced in the park. And we sang, and we sang dirges in the dark. We were singing bye bye Miss 
once American pie. Drove my Chevy to the levee, but the levee was dry. Them good old boys were drinking whiskey and rice, singing, This'll be the day that I die. This'll be the day that I die. Oh, helter skelter in a summer swelter. The birds flew off in a fallout shelter. Eight miles high, falling fast. And it piled on upon the grass. The players tried a forward pass and a jester on the sidelines in a cast. Now the halftime air was sweet perfume. What sergeants played. Chance, cause the players tried to make the field The marching man refused to yield Do you recall what was revealed the day The music died We started singing bye-bye Miss American Pie Drove my Chevy to the levee But the levee was dry And good old boys were drinking Rising. This will be the day that I die. This will be the day that I die. And there we were all in one place, a generation lost in space with no time left to start again. So come on, Jack, be nimble, Jack, be quick. Jack Flash sat on the candlestick, his fire is. Hands were clenched and fit rain. No angel born in hell could break that Satan spell. And as the claim climbed in the night to light the sacrificial rite, I saw Satan laughing with the light. The day. Singing bye bye, Miss American Pie. Drove a Chevy to the levee, but the levee was dry. Them good old boys were drinking whiskey and rye. Singing, This'll be the day that I die. This'll be the day that I die. I met a girl who sang the blues, and I asked her for some happy news, but she just smiled and turned. I went down to the sacred store where I'd heard the music years before, but the man there said the music wouldn't play. And in the streets the children screamed, the lovers cried, and the poets dreamed. Not a word was spoken, the church bells all were broken, and the tree man. They were singing bye bye, Miss American Pie. Drove my Chevy to the levee, but the levee was dry. Them good old boys were drinking whiskey and rye. Singing, This'll be the day that I die. This'll be the day that I die. And that's it. That's it. Okay. So, uh, uh, you know, I think that didn't go bad. Again, just to say, this is a first iteration of a modification of the book. And Mary has been doing this, but there's numbers of things that we need to address. And I think, you see, one of the problems here, when you're, you're pressing control return to create new lines, uh, there's a line missing there somewhere, I think, uh, somewhere in that, um, in that song. There was a line, I think, um, I'm just trying to see we oh isn't that nice i too remember that show where he where he also sang the mountains of morn magical what a voice brian mohan is here on your new Europe says that's right nigel i had forgotten the mountains of morn uh 
true incredible voice. Dave Kelly making a very good fist of that, guys. Beautiful, more, Maria Fordham says, beautiful, more difficult to sing than it looks. Yeah, I mean, it I think I think part of it, Maria, uh, uh, my memory of this, like I had a disco around the 70s and I used to play this song because, again, it's the sort of song coming into the summer that would lift people's spirits in the days of the old innocent discos we were involved in. And the thing about that song is because it was a double A side, the latter part of the song tended not to get heard. And like a lot of songs, people knew the bye, bye, Miss American, bye. Mm. And you don't know the in-between the bits. And just like uh, what we were doing with Dicey Ryder, a lot of those, and, and also... There's variations on the theme of how he sings the song and timing, etc. And to be honest with you, what I've realised, if we want to get better at doing those songs, you've got to go back and listen to the original artist and try and get your handle around those and the spacing of the songs. But it was a first on that. I think it's something I think I'd like to do again. Because mm -hmm. I think if, if one could master that song, it's a beautiful song to carry people with you in all its different phases. I think it's just gorgeous. And you know what, over the years I've read different interpretations of what it's all about and I'm saying, sure, I don't care. I have my own personal memories of of simple, loving, enjoyable, friendly feelings when life was simple, you know, and uh, I, I, you know, I maintain them and I love them. It's fantastic, you know. So we, would you just have to name before we do follow me up to Carla? All right, so, yeah, so Ray, this is, so just to say, these are all thanks to Ray Byrne, so thank Ray for having the generosity and initiative and I'm sorry Ray I haven't seen the photographs yet if there is some way in which you can send them to me on messenger before we finish I'd like to have them but and I will try in future you know it's a matter see you can send them through the metal kill group I'm not sure how we pick them up on different devices if you send them to messenger to Mary she'll get them she passed them on to me if you send them on to me I would have them on but I would have them on my device here so I can just pull them onto the screen anyway so the, the the first three songs that um we you know based on Ray's visit to the desert island that would go could keep you going for a while American Pie would keep you a, a few spins around the moon that's right yeah uh, so we had um Cliffs of Dunine. well well we had King of the Road we have we had it doesn't matter anymore and American Pie so they were two wonderful songs so the next two are Cliffs of Dunine and Follow Me Up to Carlo that's because we're so, not doing Wagon Wheel. Mm. Yeah, well, we're not doing working with tonight. I'm just no, saying. We'll, uh, we'll do it again yeah. because we need to practice. Anyway, really, don't we? we are. Uh, rather than saying what we're not doing, we're going to concentrate, Mary, on what we are I doing. I know, but I'm just saying since he asked for it, since Ray asked for it, I'm just but explaining. Ray, all of this, just Ray, you need to understand if you ask Mary for something, that it's my kind of democracy here, okay? Death, is it Cliffs of Dunin or Dead Cliffs? Cliffs, page 79, book one. Cliffs. It must be Cliffs, I I J K L M N O. Willie Sorry. Pierce is here with us. Hello, Willie Pierce. How are you doing, Willie? So it, it, it'd help us if we were on the right book, mind you. So, um, sorry. So we're in it's early on the book. Book one, again. book one's on page 79. C, 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 again. Just to say, it, Mary's calling me out work, numbers, but the book... Look, once no, not to you, I'm not calling When you repurpose the book, it comes I'm completely different. I'm calling to Sheila McMahon and Sheila, put that book away and just follow these. Get with the programme. All right, so we're going to play this, and um, I think we're playing this open, all right? Yes, it is a Tranona Y in uh, Tiernan and Oak down there in, in County Wexford, or in Wexford town, I suppose. So again, I hope you like this, Ray, and I hope you're joining in. <clears throat> Around 
the vault for the young round the cliffs of you Fare thee well to the name, fare thee well for a while And to all the fine people I'm leaving behind To the streams and the meadows where late I have been the high rocky slopes of the cliffs of Doom. So I thought that might be better a little higher than that. So Willie says, is there someone else in this group in Wexford? Well, I'm not sure. I don't know whether there's people hiding in Wexford or the drones down in the parks have found anybody there. But if there is anybody there from Wexford, say hello to Willie. Uh, I say the people from lots of different places and... Uh, you know, Wexford's in the other end of this country, so uh, sometimes the sunny southeast has to give way to the windy wild west. There's Marion McFadden from the windy wild west. Over the, the road, over the road here. So, so what? 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 Um, Ray said about the Cliffs of Drinane. I was there. Uh, Cliffs of Drinane, nineteen seventy-five. I was there with you in the town hall in the mid seventies for at least uh, one Planks Day concert magical concert in the town hall in John Talk. You yeah. were there in 72 you said last night. I think it probably was 72. I would have been in fifth year in school and uh, so the idea in those days of going out to concerts, like there's no such thing as the concerts that we see now. They were unknown in Ireland, the whole idea of a concert uh, of that nature. So it would have been 1977, 1978 for me and after travelling to America and end up working as a, as a bouncer in a Place called the Dell West, an open amphitheater in in uh, Philadelphia, and seeing people like Chris Christopherson, Crosby, Stills, Nash, and Young, Jackson, Brown, Fleetwood Mac during the Rumors tour. Wow, was I blessed to see these people! But I was into sound equipment. We moved me disco gear and to see delay lines and massive, uh, beautiful sound and systems with FM stereos, the standard versus our uh, AM noisy music single monotone stuff in Ireland that's what we had so the Planksty concert at that day those days you know they were magic but they had all of the the essence of what Planksty were and of course there are those early songs they sang including the one we're just going to sing now my memory of follow me up to Carlo comes from that time and the energy in that particular song so this is the last of Ray's uh, five on the island job I think you made lovely choices Ray by the way I think uh, if I if you'd if you'd been dumped off that island and uh, your time had been served and I was passed on to the island and I was handed your songs, I could have certainly done with uh, um, a lot worse songs than that. Absolutely. I, and I think well, somebody was asking there, will we have another chance to play five more songs? I think it might have been Natalie at some point. Um, absolutely, I believe. You that. can swap. I believe. <laughs> you can swap with other people about your things. But look, at the end of the day, we don't know. We don't know whether we'll be here tomorrow. So uh, We don't know whether you'll be here tomorrow. So we only have right now and the song we sing. But I think that, you know, you never know. This Our dream originally was with Mel Kill was that it would sprag or spread or... Uh, enthuse a movement of interest um, not that we would be world changers that's not the point but our facilitation towards that was creating a book a template that people could sing with and that's what this book has become and it's wonderful we can now leverage it and repurpose it in a different way through PDFs and the internet so tomorrow night um, we'll be doing the songs chosen by Nancy and Chuck they live in Nashville in Tennessee that is if they can if they, if they can join us because they've been without power now for four days following following a storm there um, so I think she said it, they hope that it'll be back tomorrow and if so we'll play their songs if not we'll move I think so Anya will be next yeah. I think Anya so look we're delighted I'm delighted that you've responded to Mary's request to put in again this idea of gamification of incarceration having a bit of fun learning <clears throat> and spreading the, the love around and the idea of people identifying different songs that they like so this one is uh, Follow Me Up to Carlo, and <clears throat> we're doing it on um, three, on capo position three. And uh, again, just bear with me as I, sw as I flip up the pages. That's as good as it gets, all right? <clears throat> so capo 
poetry Oh, lift me your old with your face Blueing in Arnie, oh, Miss Grayson Back into William's thought with your face Draw you to the fair Oh, curse and swear, lark and dare, fate will do what fate will dare. Now the thrill you might be care, falling into your star alone. Up the tavern, and the song, and on the window for by the Lord. Deep the gear is given the word, follow me up at the car See the swords at Glen the flesh and all the English pale, see all the children on the hill. He need no burden's fire, rooster of the fighting stock. They would you let a Saxon cock throw out upon the Irish rock, fly up and teach him manners. Curse and swear, lark and dare, Fika will do what Fika will dare. Now if it's well, The loonies, the haddies, white is sick, there is red. Now for black Fitzwilliam's head, we'll send it over to the red. And lies in her lay. Curse and swear, Lark will dare, fake will do what fake will dare. Now Fitzwilliam, have a care, falling into your star low. Up the caliber, up the sword, on the wing over my is given the word, follow me up to the car, Lord. Curse and swear, Lord, you dare, faith will do what it will dare. Now if it's William, have a care, fallen is your star, Lord. Up with Calvin, up with sword, on the wing over by the Lord. Did the give, is given the word, follow me up, follow me up, follow me up to the car, Follow me up, follow me up, follow me up, it's a car, swear, long to death, it will do what it will do. Now it's William, have a care, falling into your star, no. Up with Calvert, up with Sword, on the way go for by the Lord. The Epicure is given the word, hey, follow me up, follow me up, follow me up, it's a car, I was back there in the, uh, I was back at the back of the town hall with me hair going, tsh, 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 tsh. I'll have to wear a wig to read, you know, when you're bat on your hair, it was one foot long, see that? My hair was that plus another four inches. I know that because I used to sit in the back of the glass and I'd get a ruler out and I'd pull me hair out. You can see how long I was pulling me hair out before it's pulled out on its own. So I love that, isn't that? Follow me up, but to follow me up, but to follow me up. That was when the needle kept jumping. Follow me up, but to 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 dup dee dup dee dup. Newton night, Newton night, Newton night, na 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 Newton night, na Newton night, Newton night, Newton night, na Newton night, Newton night, Newton night, na Newton night, Newton night, Newton night, and so anyway, Nigel, I know you were meant to be Thursday night, but I think Anya would like to do. Thursday night, so then we'll move you, if you don't mind, to Friday night, and then we have Nancy and Chuck, and then we have Ruth. God, isn't it and great? Dave that Kelly, <laughs> Dave Kelly, come on. It's I like... don't know. Will you let me know if you've sent me those songs? I just may have lost them somewhere, and I know isn't there it were great COVID there were, time, the time for queues. Now we're queuing for living, and now there were queuing for giving, queuing for singing songs. You have queues, and we have like train time. To everything in the world is about timetabling. 
Ray Byrne says, many thanks for facilitating this wallow in nostalgia. That was a, that was a great way of putting that. The facilitation of our wallowing in nostalgia. Isn't this, nostalgia is a great thing all the same. Mm. I mean, fuck reality, like who needs that? You know? <laughs> I, Liam, I think you were still in the Adelphi. I was, but I wasn't in the Adelphi. That was for the um, Saturday movies. No, this was in the town hall, in the back of the town hall. You know, I had a parka jacket that I bought in Alpha Bargains in in um, in Dublin, and uh, you'd go all the way to Dublin to get a parka jacket, thinking that, that you were wearing an old army German Second World War army gear, yeah. and being cool was you know what we'll do the business. We'll do Sorry, Dicey Riley because Mary. there's five minutes until birthday, okay. so we'll work. do Dicey Riley in the so meantime. Everybody, back to back, Dicey Riley, she back into learning one hundred one, book one, one hundred one. So the wonderful thing, we, we the reason we decided to stick at Dicey Riley again a couple of nights, one because. The song grows on you, but I think one again for those people who are concerned about, uh, I'm not even sure what Mary. Do we know what key we were doing it in? Oh, oh Dicey Riley, let's Mary's see. Mary's not too. She, no, you. She's you been a bit behind on this that's one. That's not guys. true. That's not true, and you know, Dicey Riley. Mary's going to tell us now. And I will as soon as I find it. D. D. See. What page is that? Do? I'm D not sure. We're on a different page. Dicey Riley is one oh one. Yeah, but what book statue? one? No, but what? there's I'm like staring two keys. You have to give Mary's me. Not with you have the to give. I am. You have to give me a chance to find it. One oh one, Dicey Riley, key of C, and we don't have any cap on. Right, well, that's it. We're sorry. I know the page is running up and down past you, but. So what we liked about this song is that particularly there's two chords in it. So for those of you who say you'd like to practice and get, uh, um, uh, you know, get familiar with playing the songs, etc. This is a two chord song, C, effectively C and G, but maybe a G7. Um, and the other thing is the opportunity to get your head around the words of the song. So I think we were singing it slower than we did the first night. So we want to try and for us to learn and for us to try and keep an even pace on it um, and <coughs> from the imagery of the song the invitation is to go walk around those traditional streets of Dublin following this woman Dicey Riley in her fairly um, you know base body way of living and within a community that supported each other I mean they lived for each other etc <coughs> so magical sets of words and again an opportunity to get a handle on the phraseology, you know, different people might sing these things with different phrasing. So I'm not, this isn't a definitive. It's how we sing them. We hope you enjoy it. And we so, hope you sing so, along. Anyway, Brian Mohan says that song is about the oldest profession. And Sheila McMahon says, who picked that song? Which she, song? This one. She did. <laughs> hey, Louis Brown says, I think now you've cracked American Pie, you should try Dylan's Homesick Blues. We don't have that in the book, Louis. No, we, maybe we Lucia should. Lucia Gallagher from Enfield. You're welcome with your dog. Well, just to say, Ray Atkinson, I was talk Atkinson, I was talking to someone today and they'd seen you play the uh, bar on along with the uh, the song. I think it might have been Dicey, right? I'm just saying how... how um, how, um, how embellished or added in embellishment the song was by your wonderful um, bower on playing mm -hmm. and I was just saying like it, it makes me realise how in real time again we get to meet meet up with people it'd be wonderful to have all of those different um, uh, int or, or sorry, additions to our bass line in music you know I mean we're just you know but imagine if the whole lot of us were physically in the same room be able to hear each other you know maybe technology is not going to support us at this point but it's holding us together and building social cohesion so let's start with so Lucia Gallagher I was just welcoming you with your dogs uh, Ted and Lolo so Lucia plays uh, ukulele in um, the group in Trim and she lives in Enfield County Mew okay okay then Good. So I hope uh, you can join in. We're playing it open, guys. Open road, I see Riley. She has taken to the sun. The road, I see Riley. She will never give it up. Oh, it's up each morning to the farm. She goes in for another little drop of the heart of the rowlist, I see Riley. She walks along. Street 
been an independent air. Then it's down by Summer Hill and as the people stare, she says, we have passed one time I had another little one at the heart of the rowling. At the corner of the street Every evening after school I go to wash her feet She leaves me there to find the shop She dips in for another little drop Of the heart of the rowlist Dicey Riley Oh, poor old Dicey Riley She has taken to the sun Poor old Dicey Riley She will never give it Two pumps throws and out she goes as happy as a lark. She finds a bench to sleep at after at St. Patrick's Park. She'll wake at five, even in the pink. Say it's time for another little drink at the heart of oh, the Rowley's Dicey Riley. Poor old Dicey Riley, she has taken to the sun. Poor old Dicey Riley, she will never give it up. It's off each morning to the pop, and he goes in for another little jump of the heart. All the roll is Dicey Riley. Now she travelled far to a dockside bar to have another round. And after one or two or three, she doesn't feel so sound. After four, she's a bit unstable. Fancied me oblong. Lovely Becky Cooper or Maggie's Mary Wong. One woman put them all to shame, just one was worthy of the name and the day. That day was Dicey Riley. Hey, poor old Dicey Riley, she has taken to the sun. Poor old Dicey Riley, she will never give it up. Up on her like many pretty whores. It's after you along the street before you're out the doors. The balance swing and the looks all faint, but out of all that great brigade of the heart of the row was Dicey Riley. A poor old Dicey Riley, she has taken to the sun. Poor old Dicey Riley, she will never give it up. It's all. She goes in for another little drop of the heart Ah, the row is Dicey Riley Oh, they carry her home at twelve o'clock As they do every night Bring her inside, put her on the bed And then turn out the light Next morning she'll get out of bed And look for a cure for her head of the heart Ah, the row is Dicey Riley Riley, she will never give it up. It's off this morning to the pop. She goes in for another little drop of the heart. Oh, the round is Dicey Riley. 
So we've done that probably three times in a row. That I just sung it for me. I have a sense that's the best we've sang that together. Um, I think we sang it a lot slower than we certainly did the first time. Uh, and I, the most important thing is, you know, I have a sense that Mary's not used to singing, the, reading through the words of those songs. Is that right? Yeah, I know them, except for the two, two, two pubs. Yeah, so but no, but I'm saying it's only when you sing these songs numbers of times. I mean, I, that song brings back to me singing that song in a pub in Clarehead during the wild summers in Clarehead, um, many many years ago. And all I would ever hear would be the chorus, and I'm not even sure. In, in the middle of the drink, I don't know if half the people knew half the words, but the words are. I think the words are majestic, and as we sang them slower there tonight, I had a lot more pleasure out of singing the words because I could I could express the words. I don't agree with Mary saying that she knew all those words. I don't think you did. I just don't. I mean, I, I, and I, I, you know, I, I think unless you can get your mouth around words and these type of things, the balanced way, and the looks all fade, but out of all, that great brigade of the heart. So, you know, anybody who thinks you can just sing these songs and throw them out of your mouth, you're fools. It's not the way it works. Oh, but times were catching up on her like many pretty hers. And the slower you sing them songs, you can even, s I can see those pretty hers. Maybe it's just me, Mary. So anyway, Kathy maybe Anderson, just, you're welcome. Just me. And Anne Marie Clark, and we are honoured to have you with us tonight. You're obviously here for your mother's birthday. Now, Anne Marie lives in Navan, and she's a most amazing artist. Uh, and she's a beautiful singer, and I would say that her song would be Lakes of Train. So Anne-Marie, you're welcome, and Brian, and anybody else who's with you at this time. Ray Atchison, he's with us still. And uh, what else have we to say? So it's now time for the birthday, the birthday girls. That'll be Irene and Mary. At the moment, Mary's cocooning down in West Cork. Um, West, uh, Mary West Clerken says she can't connect. Oh, no. Well, somebody can play it back to her. Anne-Marie, you can tell her how to do this afterwards. Okay? But you did send us something in, um, in uh, Messenger. Not sure why that is. But there are two. So anyway, look, we have two birthday, birthday people tonight. Yeah, isn't that right? So we have Irene Hayden from Dundalk and John's wife and... Uh, a carer at the coalface with uh, a lot of the elderly and, and uh, um, people, home care people who need support in Dundalk. So she's doing wonderful work at the coalface there. Uh, and uh, uh, Mary Clerken down, hiding down and in another paradise in West Cork. West of Skibbereen, how many, many kilometres? You go eight. Down by Roaring Water Bay. Yeah. Uh, down by Hare Island. Mm -hmm. Um. You right down on the beautiful coastline amongst lovely people who are lovely people to have a sing song with. We've been down there, we've had a couple of sing songs with people and that, that was before we really got the books. Uh, well, last year we had a number, uh, we had it, we had the opportunity, glorious opportunity of singing some songs with uh, Mary and her sister Margaret and what do you call their, their friend? Marion. Marion, yeah, and mm -hmm. her husband at the time mm -hmm. and they brought us lovely fish and we had lovely fish. Mike and Marion. Yeah. Gorgeous, oh, lovely, lovely memories of that. So we're going to sing our happy, we start off, we're going to sing our happy birthday song to Irene and to Mary. Uh, we wish you, really do wish you a, a, the best um, and, and the happiest of times. And, and before we go, Anne-Marie, you might, you might tell us what the two bays are that your mother is looking at. One, I know one is Roaring Water Bay and I don't know what the other one is, but she also looks out at Jeremy Arnes, Arnes's castle. So that's... So first we'll sing our happy, so to Mary and Irene, the best wishes to you, and uh, again to Irene, testimony to all those people who are doing wonderful work holding the whole system together as we try and stay out of the way and let people come up with better solutions. Right. Happy birthday to you. Soon the birds I feel blue. Soon the birds I feel blue. 
birds that feel good To the birds that be Marie and Irene To the birds that feel good Joy is anniversary Joy is anniversary Joy is anniversary Marie and Irene Joy is anniversary And again, a lovely evening to have a birthday. I hope whoever you're with, wherever you are, you enjoy that and that this group as, you know, wish you well as we do anybody who's having a celebration and um, any, any of these coronavirus incarceration evenings that we have. So Mary says there were a couple of songs that would go along with that birthday. So the first one we'll sing for Irene Hayden is... Uh, Good night, Irene. Strangely enough, Good night, Irene. And that's in, I think it's in our first book. So we just dig that up again. You go to the book, reminding people, click on all the hyperlinked indices, etc. So interesting, even though this version of the book has been repurposed to spread out the words, all the hyperlinks follow um, uh, in the way in which they did before. So Paul um, Flaherty in Cork, he also requested us to sing this for his wife, Irene, who seems to also work at the coalface. So. so we're singing it in position three, guys, all right? <clears throat> so again, just to remind you, uh, in the event of the stream crashing out, which it has a couple of times after about an hour, I should have mentioned that. This is a bit like being on an aeroplane. In the event of a sudden loss of air pressure, we would like you to do the following things. Put on your face mask before you do it for children so that you'll be able to help them. So same way, if the stream drops out for any reason, now you may have a poor quality of stream because, you know, the internet is a variable quality at different times of moment, very under pressure with the uh, congestion on, on the web naturally. Um, but if it fails on our end, we will simply stop it and restart it as a new stream within the Facebook page. So that's all we can say if it loses it and you fancy coming for some more. We typically are playing for about 90 minutes, maybe an hour and three quarters every night, starting at eight, at seven o'clock Greenwich Mean Time, which means in, in the States, you're four or five hours behind in Brazil, same way. In Germany, you're an hour ahead of us, France the same. So um, I'd say if, if you lose the stream, if it drops out, come back in, have a cup of tea and join us again. We're on Capo 3 with Goodnight Irene. Last Saturday night I had married well, Me and my wife settled down Now me and my wife we are parted Staying out late at night. Go home to your wife and your family. Sit down, the fireside so bright. Hey, Irene, good night, Irene. good night. Good night, Irene, good night, Irene. Sometimes I live in the town Sometimes I have a great notion To jump into the river and drown No, oh, Irene, good night, Irene Irene, good night Good night, Irene, good night Folks, they like their sugar. Hey, some folks they like their wine. Some folks they like their music. They sing it all the time. Singing Irene, good night, Irene. Irene, good night. Good night, Irene, good night. So I 
actually, that might have even sounded better in four. Actually, that might have sounded better in capo position four. But look at the important thing is I think it's that people experiment with a pitch in a, that you feel comfortable in singing in. And if, for me, all I can say, for me personally, when I sing and play along and do that, I just really, it's like fucking, I don't know what cocaine is like, but it, it's, it's like a non-pharmaceutical intervention, the NPI as they call them, but I feel really good after it. Right? Just to say a little bit about that song, it was first recorded by an American blues uh, musician, singer. His name was, wait for it, Hoddy Ledgebelly, Ledgebetter, in, Led in 1933, or his name was shortened to Ledbelly, okay? And it refers to suicidal tendencies where he wanted to uh, jump in the river and drown. Obviously, he was uh, uh, he is sad, really, in many ways. He was sad and he was frustrated with whatever was going on in his life. It was obviously a woman that was causing the problem. Anyway, uh, Margaret is watching. No. Anne Marie says. Anne Marie said, Margaret, Mary said you're watching. But what you, Anne Marie said is you're waltzing. So does it oh, make any waltzing, difference? Oh, waltzing, waltzing. So if you're As watching you know, Anne -Marie, and waltzing, Anne Marie, you you will uh, make allowances for me, and we all know why. <laughs> because <laughs> oh dear, oh dear, 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 dear. I think dear, Anne, I dear, think Anne Marie. Oh, dear, I think dear, I think Anne Marie dear. understands. And he, we'll call you waltzing Matilda rather than watching Matilda. Okay, so Margaret, your turn will come. We need you to hold back on that waltz for a moment. We have a request for the Berta girl, your sister. Back at the class, Margaret. See, she's in Alina. We're going to sing the dimming of the day for Mary Clerkham. Mary has connected. She has, and we're delighted that we we uh, have your attention now, Mary. Uh, what is it we're singing? The dimming of the day. Dimming of God knows we don't know where, where, where this is pitched, of course, because... 358 book one, she Sheila. Give Mann. us both allowances, okay? Mary and Mary wants allowances for this one, okay? No, yeah. I, I'm not looking for allowances. Allowances. I was allowances. looking for allowances. Now, for the me. important thing is, Mary, do we know what we're doing here? Get with the programme. Mary said, we're going to do Dimming of the Day for Mary Clark. And I said, yeah, she yes, no her. problem. So I just wonder, have we any idea where we're going to put... That's... I don't know. Anyway, I think we'll find this song is going to be a little on the high side, I think. But, you know, did that ever matter to us when we make a fool ourselves? No. So we'll sing the song. So this is for you, Mary Clerken, and for all you and yours down in uh, in West Cork. A most welcoming, warm and welcoming place uh, in which we had then and hope to have more beautiful sing songs. I think Kay is there um, also. Uh, and... Uh, so the song is a song by um, Richard by, and Linda Thompson. Written by Richard Thompson, mm. and uh, but most gracefully sung by Bonnie. Bonnie. Bonnie Raith. Playing it open, and God knows what'll happen. This old house is falling down around my.
my confidant. I see you on the street in company. Why don't you come and aid your mind with me? Oh, I'm living. Yeah, that went well. I mean, some of, you know, Mary and I haven't uh, hadn't come to much of an accommodation about that song in the past uh, because, again, the way like people like Bonnie Raitt deliver a song, so they don't just sing the lines words one after another. They stop and they pause and mm -hmm. they allow the song. So that means when Mary and I are singing the song, we often come to the song from different um phrasings and from different thoughts in our heads about the song so it's nice when we get them and they come together and it's not really a matter of one person right or wrong it's just a matter of us getting to an alignment and that's the magic of all these songs and if you find songs in this book that you like and say look there's five songs i'd like to learn to play or learn to sing then all the better you can have a bit of fun with them and marie thank you for your kind comments um so great job to you both okay no, she didn't. She said no allowance necessary. Mary she, thinks she I didn't, didn't see that. No, she Jesus said, Christ. But what she actually said, if you must, because you said, left something out, you are amazing, Mary, is what she said. <laughs> no allowance is necessary. I look at the tell you. Great job is, to you both. Mary fills her concerts with her own with her own buddies. Mary. She, all the front rows are full of her buddies. Mary, she gives out free Mary tickets. Mary Clark says, <laughs> superb, super, she says. Never mind, get your sister Margaret out. So guys. Get her out. Wherever you are in the world, if you're out there and you're available for a, a smart young woman from West Cork, okay, with a house and a bit of land she's and looking, an old she's pension. She's looking for a fella. You know, she could be there for you and Margaret would keep you on your toes. You would be turned out smart every morning or else you'd be turned out every morning. Wondered if you weren't smart. So we've been asked to sing your sister, your darling sister, Mary, Margaret, Mary, asked to sing for you, Margaret, that we would sing, uh, and Maria. Maria, Marian, 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 how are you? watching as well. Hello, Marian, Mike. Lovely singers down oh, there. and up in West singer. Cork. And then you sit and in the so room with Kay, them. And so is by the way. Kay is yeah, there as well. But you sit in the room with them and they just, would, you could be going on forever singing. So... What was the song we were asked to sing? Uh, old, no, no, it wasn't. Old Flames. Was it? It was yeah, Old Flames. Old Flames. And, I, and I, so I wonder, is this in, in our book, first book? So as we sing, you know, the fabulous memories there of last year when we were singing away in the kitchen, next minute we turn around and Marion and Margaret are waltzing around the floor, as you do. Do we have that song? Old Flames can't hold a candle to you. Hmm. So uh, again, we haven't seen this probably since that night. So I don't know what the, the local dance hall down in Baltimore or Skibreen is called, but this will take you back to the day. I think we'll be open with see. Downtown tonight, I saw an old friend, someone who I used to take home. Oh, 
stars in the night, lost in the sweet light of dawn. Oh, flames can on a candle to you. No one can light up the light up the night like you do. Flickering embers of love. Flickering embers of love, I've known one or two. But all flames can all a candle to you. Thank you, folks. Your next dance, please. And the next dance will be a lady's choice. So Marion is here. Oh, what about uh, take well these? Done. We'll, well do take these Kathy chains. Was well done song. Now we're in a Both bit of a zone. But I want to do take these chains for anybody there. Down. Give us a song that Just you like. Just in case you're waltzing around the floor there. Uh, uh, oh, take these chains. Take yeah, take these chains. Ah uh -huh, yes, that's okay. We should do scar. Oh, somebody has asked for Scarborough Fair shortly. Yeah. Mm. Okay, well, we'll, uh, we'll do this, take these chains, then we'll go back to Scarborough Fair. <clears throat> okay? Mm -hmm. Take these chains. Two. We'll try it in two and see how it goes. What was that last song we did? The last song was All Flames. Did I, we didn't do it open, did we? We did. No, I just want to write that, I want to note that in there. So we better write these things down. Take these, we kind of play this in capo too. Take these chains from my heart and set me free. You've grown cold and no longer care for me. All my faith in you is gone, but the heart is So guys down to Clarkins and company and family and all down to West Cork. What about Chris? Delighted. The other side of nowhere. Mm -hmm. So obviously where the other side of nowhere is, uh, where is the other side of nowhere? The other side of nowhere. Nigel O'Mahony is asking for that. No, I just want to see if it's in Margaret the, the has passed her life dancing by herself. <laughs> you should at least get the well, broom. That's for you so should at least get the broom out. That's right. Well, now that's, now that's simply because of social distancing. Is it? What sort of thing? Physically distance rather than socially distant, surely. The other side of nowhere. The other, where is it? Where is just it? the other side of nowhere. But just, sorry, just sorry, the other side of nowhere. IJ. Just the 
I, I J K L M Gorin, not on his lexic, but uh, just the other side. <clears throat> so why don't we try it, Nigel, and try this? And don't, not idea where, not just don't know what we where we'll pitch it, but anyway, we'll see. It's, it's open, we'll play it open and see how this goes. So, Nigel, so you like this song, tell us what you like about it. For me, I once had a long journey in a Renault 4 all the way from one side of the country to the other, singing this song endlessly. And I just, it was in a summer's evening, lovely thought, lovely memories. I come from just the other side of nowhere to this big town, lonesome town. Got a lot of ice and snow here Half as cold as all the people I found Everywhere I try to go here Seems to bring me down I've seen about enough to know where I belong It's I've got a mind to see the headlights shining on that old white line between my heart and home. Sickness spending some days, wishing they were Mondays, sitting in a park alone. So give my best to anyone who's left who's ever done me any little way but wrong. Tell them that the pride are just the other side of nowhere is going home. Oh, taking nothing back to show here for these dues I pay. But the soul I almost sold here and the body I've been given away. Fading from the neon nighttime glow here, heading for the light of day, just the other side of nowhere, going home. I've got a mind to see the headlights shining on that old white line between my heart and home. Sick as fan and Sundays, wishing they were Mondays, sitting in a park alone. So give my best to anyone who's left, who's ever done me any loving way but wrong. Tell them that the pride of just the other side of nowhere's going on. Sunday morning. So Mary thinks that leads on to Sunday morning coming down. Oh, we do. So wishing, spending, sitting in a park Sundays, wishing they were Mondays. And now we so, wow, Sundays and Mondays in, in uh, Nashville, whatever, whatever they like. Anyway, lovely. Uh, so from spinning from one side of the country to the other to Sunday morning coming down. Another magical song. And when we were graced to see uh, or honoured to see Chris Christopherson two years ago, I think it was two years in ago, Castlebar. in Castlebar, mm. you know, uh, you know, and still for two hours, one hour and 50 minutes, two hours with a 10 minute break, he stood and performed these magical songs and uh, about 3,000 people there and every single soul person in the place knew every solitary word of what he sang and when he sang this song, Everybody there sang their own song. I think my sense, they all almost had their eyes closed, sing, uh, singing their own memory, their own Including version. my two sisters who were across the way from us. We didn't know they were there. That was Angela and Margaret. We could and hear they, them though. But they sent me a recording afterwards of the two of them singing along with, with Chris. Okay. 
That's right. Well, I woke up Sunday morning with no way to hold my head that didn't hurt. And the beer I had for breakfast wasn't bad, so I had one more for dessert. Then I fumbled through my closet for my clothes and found my cleanest dirty shoes. And I shaved my face and combed my hair and stumbled down the stairs to meet the day. I'd smoked my brain the night before on cigarettes and songs and I'd been picking. Then I lit my first and watched the small kid cursing at the can that he was kicking. Then I crossed the empty street and caught the Sunday smell of someone frying chicken. And it brought me back to something that I'd lost somehow or somewhere along the way. All together. On that sunny morning sidewalk, wishing Lord that I was stone. On a sleeping city sidewalk Sunday morning coming down In a park I saw a daddy With a laughing little girl And he was swinging And I stopped beside a Sunday school And listened to the song So now that we're on the, on the Chris Gustafson yeah, road, let's have another one. what about the silver tongue devil oh, and yes, I? Yes, yes, yes. Again in that uh, vein, the silver tongue. Is that a lovely Wouldn't name? it be nice just to have one evening of Chris songs and another one of yeah. Niall Young songs, wouldn't it? Yeah, that's... Uh, Anybody up for that? The uh, What do I call it? The silver tongue yeah. devil. The silver tongue devil and I. That's a song before we'll have to do, The Shoals of Herring. With our nets and gear we're faring. That's another one we will do. But the silver we tongue. We do that when we're doing our, our, sea, our, our, our sea, sea shanties. The toll of single bell church, single church bell spells loneliness. Yeah, again, I'm not sure. You know, while that song does uh, in some way speak of loneliness, it also speaks to me of time for reflection. That's with that song. Lots of my Sunday mornings spent when I was in university, Sunday afternoons wandering around 
um, Phoenix or Grafton Street and uh, Stevens Green and up around Leeson Park and down to Canals. We're spent kicking cans, having fun, having no money to spend, but haven't had a good Saturday night and a bit of fun, slept in Sunday morning, but in ease of reflection. So I'm not sure, again, maybe... So they're all looking said, for a night of Chris. Sometimes. Yeah, they're all looking for Chris for a I whole night. I took myself yeah. down. I'm going to try this one up and just see, because I just know at the bottom end, sometimes the whole Chris thing can come up a little and allows you to be a bit more... Expansive in the bottom end. Oh, and you says the last song uh, made her night. Uh, Ray Atchison said that, that it, Ray Atchison said that'd be great. Mary, love Chris and Neil Young. Okay. Yeah, well, we'll 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 dig we'll highlight those and dig them out. One. Look at them. Is it? So yeah, we're going to try it in one and see what it looks like. Again, I think this is how these songs come from. They're so apt, and you can. I, I think I can read myself into the characters. I took myself down to Tally Old Tavern to buy me a bottle of beer. I sat me down by a tender young maiden whose eyes were dark as her hand. And as I was searching from bottle
Cathy Anderson says, Hi Liam, instead of kicking old tin cans, you should have been going to Mass. Mm. Cathy Anderson, how presumptive of you. Couldn't I have been kicking cans on my way to Mass and on my way back down in the CUS church down in Leeson Street on a Sunday morning? Couldn't I have been doing that? I'm telling you. So, uh, Aussie, Aussie... I probably was doing that. I would have done that a lot in those days. Ten to six every night I used to go to Mass in CUS and Leeson Street on the way back on my way because dinner would have been quarter to six hours and the dinner would have been at six o'clock over in University Hall in Hat Street, the hostel I stayed in. And I did it, and I did it, you know, I did it as part of my development or whatever, and I was very comfortable doing it. So... Kick the can, kick the can, one, two, three. So, Ozzy Gallagher. Play that song? Yeah. Ozzy Gallagher. Ozzy Gallagher, you're welcome here. I don't think you've been here before. I, I'm not sure where you're from either, but you might let us know. I love Sunday Morning Coming Down by Johnny Cash. Yeah. Kathy. And uh, so, Ozzy, you're welcome. I hope you're enjoying it. Most important, I hope you get the chance to sing. And Mary asked, one more song we go before we before tidy you up for night. Yeah. Mary said, Take the ribbon take from my heart. Take the ribbon. It? From take, 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 tapestry, what about tapestry, let us no, take these no, chains, yeah, sorry, take the ribbon from your hair, oh dear, so it's, that's not what it is, it take the ribbon from your hair, is it, I think so, anybody there know what the song is called, I think it's take, take the ribbon, anyway, we're looking and see, let's just see, it's, it'll be it's in the ice, yeah, take the ribbon, that's not take the ribbon from my hair, what's, the, what's it called then, What's the name of that song, folks? Take the, take the ribbon from your hair. Shake it loose and let it fall. Lord, I'm taking it. Help me make it through the night. Okay, help me. Now, wouldn't we be great at quizzes, wouldn't we? This, we could have a quiz here. So maybe somebody put a quiz together on these songs. Would that be really good? Help me make it through the night, yeah, okay? that's it. So we'll have to find out how to leave it on one, yeah. Loose and let it fall. Lay it soft against my skin. So we we'll leave it on one. Leave it in capo one and try this, okay? Um, help me make it. That's it, Tanya. Yeah. So um, Thank anyway, you look at you can see Thank the direction. You. A bit of flow comes in, and we uh, head and uh, sing different songs. So yeah, we do a Chris and, and uh, Neil Young and Knight as well. So lots of things on the cards. Again, go back to the Desert Island Disc. Thanks very much to Rayburn tonight for your contributions. Um, they were Cliff Sudanine, Follow Me Up to Carlo, It Doesn't Matter Anymore, American Pie, King of the Road. Lovely selection of songs. Tomorrow, who are we going to... Well, we're either going to do... Well, we're if, if we have Nancy and Chuck with us back, we'll do their songs. If we don't, who else? No, well, there's Anya. There's Anya. I think we might just do Anya. Uh, Anya, I'm not sure... Anyway, Her, during the day tomorrow, Mary will Nigel, put up the song. Nigel had offered to sing on, to put his songs on Thursday night, but in the meantime, before he sent in his, um, Nigel, before you send in your list, various other people sent in theirs. So I, the thing about it is either yours or Anya's tomorrow night. Now, yeah, Anya, so Mary will post Anya, let me day. know if you're, you know. And do please send not some. Be here. Send some. For, you were doing what your mum taught you to do. Now, my father taught me how to do those things, Kathy Anderson. You know, my father used to bring us to mass every day at eight o'clock when we were kids, and my mother would make the breakfast. My father bring us away from the house over to the old Friary Church before we go to school. Life was simple then. I, we didn't have to worry about whether there was a god or no god or an afterlife or before life or a hinterlife or a better life or a worse life or any life or any viruses or any incarceration. We just had a simple life. Went to school, went in the mitch, got into trouble, got slapped, played football, was in a gang, you know. Just uh, three old fathers, three old Marys, went to church, went to confession, told me, to, made up the regular few sins, and then every now and then throw in, I had bad thoughts, Father, and then he gave you a bit of uh, penance, and you went away and you were clean for another week. Okay. Wow, if only I could recreate those simple times, my cynicism would all go away. Take, we're on uh, Kappa One. Take the ribbon from your head. And let it fall. Lay it soft against my skin, like the shadow on the wall. Come and lay down by my side till the early morning light. All I'm taking is your time. Help me make it through the night I don't care who's right 
better off I don't try to understand Let the devil take tomorrow Lord, tonight I need a friend Yesterday is dead and gone And tomorrow's out its sight to be alone Help me make it through the night I don't care who's right or wrong I don't try to understand Let the devil take tomorrow Today is dead and gone, and tomorrow's out of sight, and it's sad to be alone. Help me make it through the night. I'm going to try that uh, just again, and uh, one up, and just two. Ruth Cleary, you're right. Sandra used to sing the song, so Sandra. Uh, from North Mayo used to sing with us in Letter Kenny yeah. and when she sang the song she's such a powerful everybody, majestic everybody else get out of there yeah, no, it was such it? a majestic yeah. everybody else got, get out of the way no it wasn't yeah. that it was the oh, fact she was wonderful she was well, it wasn't wonderful. a question anybody else getting out of the way I don't agree with you Mary. no well uh, you may not agree with me Liam but I, what I don't mean by that she pushed everybody aside I mean her voice was outstanding Okay, and the rest of us were just, <laughs> we were just shadows in her wake. In her, in her omnipotent opulence. Yeah, and I wish system. Sandra, I would love Sandra. If yeah, she, Sandra, if she would, you're, if she would listen Daniel, to us. Yeah. if you'd get off. What Sandra is, she had such a magical voice, she was afraid of her own voice, it was so beautiful. Because when she opened up, it just took over, and magically so, and it's very hard to... I suppose just to be comfortable in your skin when you're born with a voice like that. But just play it up in two. Is I think I, when you listen to Chris Christopherson's song, especially on that album, when he hits the bottom notes, he doesn't tend to sing them. He opens his mouth and the words fall out. And the difficulty in trying to sing in this type of environment to do that, you have to have an excellent PA system and a quiet audience. And uh, Mary's very noisy in the background. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking, I swear to God I'm joking. You're, you're Up on no, two, no take the, the ribbon from your hair. Shake it loose and let it fall. Lay it soft against my skin. Like the shadows on the wall. Come and lay down by my side. Till the early morning light All I'm taking is your time Help me make it through the night I don't care who's right or wrong I won't try to understand Let the devil take tomorrow And it's sad to be alone Help me make it through the night So I think the, uh, what I'm saying about a lot of those songs is that experiment with them, take your guitar out, try them up and down, Ruth, I know you're practicing away, but move, if you move the capo up one fret or down a fret, you might find it make a huge difference to where the sweet spot in the song is for you. So again, uh, a, bit, a few gremlins there for Dave Kelly, a bit of a break up online again. I'm glad we didn't seem to lose our stream tonight. Again, all of these songs, you can just press save video on Facebook if you want to use them as a vehicle for practicing or a bit of motivation to do them. Um, somewhere in the back of my request is to, is to download them all and upload them up to some to YouTube. Just as usual, lots of promises, a bit like the government. Um, mm. Less delivery, but no end of promises. 
So we're going to end up again with our uh, our final song every night, which is we love to do them is the parting glass simply because of its uh, now where do we get parting glass? Sorry, I have to keep striding stride across here until we find it. Yep, there we have it there somewhere. So again, until it's a uh, Wednesday the eighth of May. Uh, six and, uh, six. Sorry. Wednesday the 6th of May. Mary, Mary, Clerkin's birthday and uh, Irene's as well. Yeah, so I hope you guys, and I hope you guys down in, in uh, I, I was going to do, I hope we might get around to singing Poncho Train for you, Anne Marie. Anne Marie, yeah. <laughs> well, maybe we might do, we that, do that tomorrow. tomorrow night, so yeah, come back in at any time, anybody, feel free. Look, if this in any way supports you in the journey that we're through, again, Fergus too, you and various people around have been around, Ray Atchison and Paul Griffin and Paul Flaherty, Dave Kelly, Anya, Nigel O'Mahony, uh, Ray Atchison, um, Ozzy Gallagher, etc. All those people have been with us. And again, John Coyle in the background. I hope you're, I really hope you're enjoying. I'm sure you're getting a chance to play all sorts of fills and all that with your guitar, John. Looking forward to singing again with you soon. We missed that. But Ruth says, thanks for a lovely evening. As uh, Ray Atchison says, thank you for a lovely evening as well. Enjoy the songs this okay, evening. Okay, Cabo 4, let's go. Um, of all the money, money that I spend, I spend it in good company, and all the harm there I did, alas, it was in none but me, and all I've done for one dog. Guys, thanks again to everybody for being here for each other, with each other, um, and to have sung along and to, you know, to share the this wonderful, I mean, you know, we've been given this opportunity in our lives to step aside from the fray and uh, hopefully there appears a reflection and various thoughts going on for different people about what matters and if things matter, etc., and part of that has been for us is this idea of having a an online daily sing song for the soul which is what we perceive it as being and we hope you enjoy it and if you want to share this video or any of the other ones or the sense that we're doing this at the moment we're here every night at seven o'clock until we until can, we change the time until we can decide how yeah. to reposition this in some way shape or form mm -hmm. and uh, we're delighted and also it's lovely that people contribute in terms of suggestions around songs and yes there are a couple of things lining up. The idea of doing a night of 
Neil Young and Chris Christopherson songs, uh, maybe Leonard Cohen and somebody else, and uh, the number of sea shanties we'd like sea songs. There's another, and maybe five or six or seven songs we have a could do to do those just as a particular set of a night. So look, we've plenty to keep us occupied for the next while. Isn't that a wonderful thing? Poor old Diego got a tick. Have you a picture? Oh, we will do that again. Diego's tick. So we had to operate them last night to pick a tick from out here. <laughs> So we're very good at this. We can't, can't be, our eyesight isn't such that we can see the detail tick. So we use we use our cameras to shoot the tick. I wonder if and, there's a tick. Uh, in it. It sounds like there's a tick. Mary in it. thinks he's more ticks. Tick, I think there's a tick in his ear. Actually, there's something strange. Now we, in now his we ear. think there's a tick in his ear. Oh yeah, I must put the tick. So now isn't that wonderful? The wonders of new technology. Oh. So taking that picture with the camera. I could clarify that I had removed the tick with Mary's tweezers and all of the little spikes out of the tick. Isn't that mm. wonderful? So once you know how to pinpoint, pinpoint your camera, you don't need the detail of your own eyes. Anyway, mm, I so. suppose when we're walking around in the long grass down in the marker, it's quite easy to pick them up, you know. Mm. Uh, anyway, we'll, we'll have to have a look in his ear now to see. Yeah, we'll have to experiment with him again, okay? Yeah. Our, you know, no vet, you have to do your own thing at these times. Anyway, look at guys. Good night, God Good night, Sloan. Until uh, tomorrow evening, 7 p.m. GMT. Good night, Sloan. August Collie Soul.